another window. So what happens when the doorknob goes through the window? We'll get her done though. Get her done! New piece of glass. Hopefully he'll be able to fix it Hopefully. without breaking it. <laughs> uh, otherwise we'll make another trip to the hardware store tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> Got the rivets, got the uh, putty to put in there to seal it all in. Uh, I just got to drill out a couple rivets, actually three, and uh, we'll be able to get it, the frame all apart and start getting this put in. But first, stop at my mom's house to grab some stuff and then dinner. Yes. We're all getting hangry. <laughs> Not really, but the hungry. hangry monster. <laughs> Yeah, it's been pretty good. Um, got up here to this spot and we, we backed in. Us with bees. <laughs> yes, it's got a lot of bees. Uh, we backed into this you spot can have it. at night. Did pretty good. We didn't get into a fight or anything. Uh, so that's always a plus. <laughs> um, and yay us. We went and got water and dumped and everything. We came back. One try, same tracks, same spot on our uh, levelers and everything it was perfect. We're shocked. But it's been good. Um, learning curve with the kids and everything because we're in such a small space. Um, get to see cows every morning. They kind of wake us up Ouch. in a way. Uh, we met a nice couple here from New Hampshire. No complaints. It's been nice in the day and cool at night, so it's easy to sleep. It's not too hot. My first week of full-time traveling or camping, as it were. Uh, definitely a learning curve. Like Adam said, uh, we managed not to argue when we put the trailer in uh, the spot the first time. We got it on exactly where it needed to be the first time, the second time we came in. And uh, yeah, so those things are plus, but it's definitely a learning curve being in a small space. But the advantage is we don't have a lot of stuff. So it's a small space, but a lot of people, but not a lot of stuff. So just getting into a routine of uh, getting up in the morning and putting the table back together so we can eat and making breakfast and 
not using all the propane and using the grill to my advantage. Um, so different things like that. But I think that we have done really well and we went, I think, almost a whole week without filling up again with water. That does not include showers, but um, I thought that was really good, especially since the kids have a horrible time at conserving water. Ashlyn keeps the uh, toilet open for an incessant amount of time, which is very irritating. But um, other than that, I think that we have done well and we are planning our trips to southern areas, maybe Prescott, Sedona. So keep on watching our uh, videos coming up for adventures through the fall.